Welcome to DWS Market Update. The time surrounding the turn of the year is always a good opportunity to reflect on the past year and consider which lessons have been learned. Generally, one lesson from 2023 is that the markets underestimated the determination of central banks in fighting inflation. One year ago, that is by mid-December 2022, Markets had priced an ECB policy rate of 3% by the end of 2023. However, the ECB actually hiked the deposit rate, which remains the key policy rate, to 4%. Faced with the choice of fighting inflation or alternatively supporting the economy, the European Central Bank, like other large central banks, has clearly opted to restore price stability. A second, not entirely unexpected lesson from 2023 is that monetary policy works, although with a certain time lag. According to the textbooks, a policy rate above the neutral interest rate should dampen both the economy and inflation. That is exactly what we can witness at the moment. Economic momentum is slowing down and inflation rates are falling. Why is this worth emphasizing? Well, from time to time, we are hearing voices that predict that inflation rates are likely to remain high for a long time, for example at around 5%. Such a statement would imply that either the neutral interest rate should be much higher, so that the current monetary policy stance would not be restrictive at all, or that the textbooks are wrong. Our third lesson from 2023 is that the real economy as well as the banking sector and financial markets have proved surprisingly resilient, despite the sharp rise in interest rates. After all, given the losses that the rate hikes have caused in some areas over the last two years, there have only been some isolated cases of stress in the financial system. On balance, we might remember 2023 as a capital markets year when investors achieved a remarkable performance despite some initial doubts. That's it for today. Thanks for watching and goodbye.